Hey guys, what is up? Oliver Will BC here, and today I'm on FIFA 18. Um, I wanted to make a series just for the end of FIFA 18, so that I had something, you know, to do before FIFA 19 came out. I am, am going to do a series for FIFA 19, but I'm not going to reveal it yet. Uh, so yeah, here I am, am. I don't actually know the name of the series. Yet. It's something like Liverpool to Glory or something like that. Anyway, here are the rules. So the rules of this series are incredibly basic, guys. So as you can see here on the screen, a win equals one upgrade. Each goal scored in a win equals one upgrade. So pretty much, you know, if I get a win, say it's 3-2, I get four upgrades. If I win 1-0, I only get two upgrades. If I draw, I get one upgrade. So no matter what, if I draw 14 all, I get one upgrade. If I draw nil all, I get one upgrade. This is where it gets interesting though, guys. If I lose, I have to replace the, my highest rated player for lo the lowest rated Everton player in that position for a game. If I lose back-to-back -back games, then I have to keep previously obtained Everton card for another match. So pretty much, if I lose 11 games in a row, which I hope doesn't happen, it shouldn't happen, then I'll have a full lowest rated Everton team possible. And that will stay in my team until I eventually win, then I'll go back to my Liverpool team. And I've mentioned upgrades a lot. How did upgrades work? On the right, you guys can see the upgrades go from bronze to silver to gold to inform slash man of the match slash player of the month. And then those can be upgraded to team of the season. So pretty much Ben Woodburn can be upgraded to, I don't know, Ajaria. Ajaria can be upgraded to Markovic. Markovic can be upgraded to inform Chan. Inform Chan can be upgraded to team of the season, Sadio Mane. Anyway, guys, those are the basic rules. Let's get into the video. I've just finished editing the video and everything, guys, and I just realized that I completely forgot to mention that my team has to be upgraded so that the entire starting 11 is gold before I can go to the next level. So I can't have, like, an informed Firmino at striker and have, like, silver trailers on the right back, for example. My whole starting 11 has to be gold, and then from there I can upgrade. So in net, I have Shamal George here. I've never seen him play. Uh, I don't think he's never played for the... Uh, Liverpool 11, uh, main 11. Now on to the right back, we have someone who is actually in the first team, which is pretty funny considering, you know, he's our worst right back, who's actually our starting one. We got Trent Alexander-Arnold, don't have to speak too much about that, we all obviously know about him. Our first centre back is Lloyd-Jones, I uh, haven't actually heard about this guy until now, um, don't know much about him. At left centre back we have Jordan Williams, he's actually centre mid, but we're playing him centre back just because of the lack of options. At left back, we have Joe Gomez. The reason I'm playing Joe Gomez left back, not centre back, and then hanging hanging left back, is because the worst left back in Liverpool is actually um, Robertson. And I thought, we'd, I didn't really want to have a goal in the lineup to start, so that's why we're doing that. We're running a 4-4-2, by the way. At right, centre mi at right middle, sorry, I have Ajaria. Um, there was a right wing who was worse, an American, I can't remember his name, but he's actually extinct on the market, so we're just doing it with Ijario. At right centre mid, we have Cam Brannigan, now of Derby County. I think he's on loan, correct me if I'm wrong. Left centre mid, we got Gruich. He's actually a pretty good player, I'm excited to use him. I've used him a little bit, as you guys can see. Left mid, we have Benny Woodburn. He's born the same year I am, so that's pretty funny. Uh, we've all heard of him, I'm sure. Right wing... We have Dominic Solanke. I was actually really happy when we signed him from Chelsea. I believe in 26 appearances, he only has the one goal, though. So, um, I'm, I'm hoping he'll come good. And then at left striker, we got Liverpool's hope of the future. He's actually younger than me, Ryan Brewster. I believe he got a hat-trick or something ridiculous in the final of the under-18s or under-21 World Cup, which England won last year. So that's really cool. I'm actually excited to use him. I have not used him or FIFA. That is the team... Uh, in its all. You guys can see there, we got Klopp as the manager, obviously. And yeah, let's get into the first Division 5 game. I found it, I found a game. Guys, I found a game. It's been it's been 30 minutes, pretty much. I've actually found a damn game. Oh my goodness, I didn't think it was gonna happen. I was literally just about to give up. Oh, I wish I did. It's got Farman, Piszczek, Socrates, Ginter, Inform, Burnett, Taliso, Keita, my man, uh, Thiago Alcantara, Hamas Rodriguez, Werner, and Coman up front. This is going to be a test, that's for sure. I think I'm going to have an Everton player next game. <laughs> I want to stay positive, but I'm, I'm thinking there's going to be an Everton player involved. I think it's this. We're looking good. There we go, that was a tough pass. I honestly wasn't expecting that to... What a play! 
There we go. First goal of the series. I believe it's Ajaria playing out of position at right middle. He slotted it. Slotted it. 1 0, 34 minutes in. We have a chance to get a result from this game. There we go. Even if I draw it, I can get one upgrade. That that will be <laughs> very useful at this point. It means I can get a Danny Ward in goal or something like that. I don't know. Uh oh. Nabi Kata, don't do it to me. Oh, that hurts. Nabi Kata has done it to Liverpool. Equalizes it one all. Not gonna lie, that really hurts. <laughs> He's one Liverpool player he has, has done that to us. There's no one there for him. Come on, Slanky, let's go left here. Well, there we go. Come on, Dom. Brannigan, he's had a few of those. Come on, Ryan. What are you going to do with it? Let's send in Brannigan. Brannigan! Let's go! I need to waste a little bit of time. I was going to pick up the ball, but that looks nothing like Cam Brannigan, but I'll take it. <laughs> it was a fantastic run through the middle by him and an even better finish. Oh, no. Oh, that's an equalizer. George has been good, but he's not going to stop Werner from there. All is good in the world still. Oh, that's good play. The Ryan Brewster, completely out of position, but I don't mind if he's doing this. One more. Come on, Woody. Woodburn? Good stop by Farmer. Uh-oh. Oh, I, don't, I have no pace. No, don't do it. Don't... Come on, kick a boost. Good use of it. Aside from the hair, I'm almost certain that this is Bujanic. <laughs> Salt to the Wounds, it's an Everton card. Let's chuck in... I have to know, what, what's his actual name? Anthony Evans. Okay, we'll just call him, we'll just call him Vuj. We have Vuj in the midfield now, along with Brannigan. <laughs> um, yeah. I, I still can't believe that that game just happened. I don't know how I lost. Anyway, let's get into the second game of the video. All right, so we actually we actually found the second match in about oh for like under a minute. Crazy stuff. They must really want me to use this Everton player. I hope this guy's got a similar team to me. An all Japanese team. I respect that. That's cool. More people have to just have fun at the end of FIFA. I can't believe people still take it seriously at this point. In a way, the left forwards. Uh, got that amazing goal against Belgium. He's got Kagawa Honda, the recent Melbourne victory signing. He got Yoshida. He had four string goals. He's not fully committed. My team is 100% going to be full Everton by the end of the series. But I'm going to 10. Wow. That pretty much sums it up. The goalkeeper run was so inevitable. It's like he still can't do anything. He is so trash. I honestly cannot wait to get my bronze Everton player to replace Slanky for the next game. I was only going to play two games in the first episode, three in every other episode, but after that I need to play another game. This guy can't be worse than Slanky, surely. He's 6-1, 2 star skills, 58 finishing, 46 composure, he's got 77 pace, I think he beats Dominic Slanky there. That is the worst purchase I've ever made in any FIFA. No, no, I bought Slanky for a grand. Second worst purchase I've ever made in FIFA. <sighs> Let's put him in the squad. Okay, we finally found the third game, guys. I think I'm a genius. I replaced all my silvers on the bench for my highest rated cards, and I found a game immediately. I think I just wasn't finding games because they couldn't get anyone of similar rating. Okay, we actually have a chance in this game against Vardy Party. It's a full we got Trent as well. What are the chances? We both have Trent. <laughs> I don't know what this guy's game is though. He's just chucked all his silvers in his team or something? I don't know. I did. I have no idea what this guy's going for here. We need to take advantage of this. We need upgrades so badly. We have Brewster and that 54 rated striker. I can't remember the name of it. It's been so long now. Sambu maybe? Something like that. Worth a shot. 
He's gonna straight back to me though. Ref gets in the way. Let's turn him. Sambu? Ryan Brewster! Goalkeeper didn't even move. We'll just take the ball from the back of the net. We got more business to do. 1 0 inside five minutes. That's what we need. I need to focus. I need to win so badly. <laughs> oh no. Verdi is through. What's he gonna do with it? He's hit it. He's low driven. I wasn't actually expecting this player to know how to do low driven shots. But uh, yeah, he's there. Maybe he's not as bad as I thought he was be. Oh no. How have I not saved that? George. George, man. I expect George to save that. Oh, Trent actually does look like Trent. Okay, cool. I don't have high hopes. I was expecting better than that, though. I definitely don't need to upgrade my defense anytime soon. They've been sold, to be fair. Okay, let's send in Woodburn. I believe this is. One more. Outside. Inside. Come on. Come on, surely. Let's go. Uh, this guy dabbed me, so I don't... Oh, no. Sambo doesn't want to do it. Fine. <laughs> doesn't want to celebrate too much for Liverpool kid, I suppose. Alright, let's... I'm going to switch on the defensive now. I don't like doing it normally, but I need to get an upgrade so badly. We got a draw, guys. <laughs> I swear I'm not normally this bad at FIFA. Uh, one draw out of three games in Div 5 is not good by any means. But, guys, try making this team playing with it. It is not good. <sighs> I'm going to get out of this game, make the upgrade I have, and uh, yeah, I'll see you when I'm done. So that's the scene we started with, now we get one upgrade. So I'm going to go from a bronze to a silver, or a silver to a gold. I'm tempted to replace the bronze with a silver goalkeeper, but I honestly don't know if there's much difference between a bronze and a silver goalkeeper, so I don't think I'm going to do that. I could upgrade one of these bronzes, bring in a silver left back, and then move Jomez, but I don't think Liverpool, have, Liverpool don't have a silver left back. So what I actually think I'm going to do is we need to get goals so that we can get more upgrades. So I'm actually going to replace Dominic Solanke with Bobby Firmino. We have got Bobby Firmino in our squad now instead of Dominic Solanke. That is quite the upgrade. I also got him with the Hunter chemistry style, which is good. Uh, Dominic, he has 84 finishing, 78 composure, 77 strength, 88 stamina. Those are the main stats. Obviously about a striker, but I just wanted someone who can actually pass the damn thing. He has 84 short pass, 81 curve, 84 vision. I think he's going to be a fantastic addition to the squad. He might even have better defender than our defenders. Okay, he's got scarily close defending to uh, <laughs> Williams. It's single digits difference in the two, between the two. Anyway though, we have strengthened our team massively with Bobby Firmino up front now. I think that this is going to help out the whole team because he's our highest shooting He's up there in pace, even. Dribbling. He's our best player in every way, pretty much. Anyway, guys, hopefully enjoy the first episode of this series. Um, and, yeah, leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you want more. And see you next time.